YouTube. I'm back. Well, we're going to play, you know, 20 questions. Okay. But he's only going to be answering them because, you know, it's him. And I'm just going to be asking them because uh, I'm too awesome to be answering questions. Duh. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so. If you learned you had only 120 days left to live, how would you spend those days? Doing everything I possibly could. <laughs> Good. What is your favorite saying? Favorite saying? Fuck you. <laughs> <laughs> That's nice. That's a pleasant saying. I like that saying. I felt like it just got darker. Oh. Okay. What is your greatest fear? Fucking clowns. Especially zombie <laughs> clowns. <laughs> uh... Go skydiving and then the parachute does not open. That would suck. <laughs> Dude, yeah, like Final Destination. Okay. What historical person do you most admire and why? Poseidon, because, you know, he's awesome. Yeah, but he's not a historical figure. Oh, wait, yeah. <laughs> he's a historical <laughs> figure. <laughs> I am. Uh, Abraham Lincoln because he got motherfucker that was mine <laughs> because he got shot and he has a big beard and he has a big hat and he's just cool. <laughs> uh, I think I would probably go with Martin Luther King because he helped set slaves free. <laughs> there you go. Oh, dude, I didn't even think of him. Okay. What living person do you most admire and why? Um, myself because I'm awesome. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Um, on what occasion, wait, on what kind of occasions do you lie? Um, stupid occasions? Duh. Um, I only lie when it's, like, really necessary. Yeah. Okay, um, what living person do you despise and why? <laughs> oh, my grandma. Because she's just a bitch. <laughs> You hate your grandma? That's nice. I'm talking about your mom. Oh. <laughs> That's a different story. <laughs> um, who do I despise? Who do I despise? Your mom. Mm, I would say her, but... Frank. Oh, yeah. <laughs> My uncle Frank. I despise him the most. That's great. Okay, so... At what time in your life... Were you the happiest being? Wait, what? <laughs> <laughs> oh, what? And where? I'm not. Never mind. Never mind. Never mind. Okay, we're just gonna go on to the next one. <laughs> what is your favorite journey so far? Probably because you've only been to California, so that's probably gonna be. Your I've been to Colorado. Journey. That kind of sucked. <laughs> Yeah, but you sat there with Heather. Not, yeah. No offense to Heather, but, like, it's Heather. Yeah, I would have to go with California. <laughs> <laughs> um, what is your most prized possession? My books. If somebody steals my books, you're gonna get killed. Get your neck chopped off or something. I don't know. <laughs> I'm joking, I'm not a murderer. <laughs> <laughs> I would have to go with video games. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah. That's true. <laughs> um, what is your greatest talent? I don't really have talent. I just, I'm just naturally funny. <laughs> okay. Um, I'm sorry, hmm. I'm texting. <laughs> I don't think I have a good talent, do I? Nope, nope. don't really have one, sorry. <laughs> what talent would you like to have? Invisibility. I know that's not really talent, but... If you That's his it... favorite superpower or something. No. There's people... I said talent. Okay, I want to be like Lucy. I want to be able to unlock my brain and like... Go... <laughs> yeah. <laughs> uh, uh, I would probably want to be able to play the piano. It's a real good instrument, so... Yeah. What words or phrases do you overuse? Uh. <laughs> fuck you. 
I would have to say you're you're a bitch. Yeah, I say that a lot. Well, they won't be a bitch. I won't call them a bitch. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Um, what is your greatest re- regret? Eating Carl's Jr. I get, like, food poisoning from there, so I'm never eating there again. And I always go back and end up eating there and then getting sick. That's my greatest re- regret. Otherwise, I don't really have anything else. Hmm. Mine is going to Colorado. It sucked. Like, horribly. <laughs> okay. What do you most like or dislike about your appearance? I most like my appearance that my eyes, because I just, like, think my eyes are amazing. Ugh. And I just, like, hate all this. Besides my eyes. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Uh, I dislike that I'm fat. Yeah. <laughs> but, you know, you can't really do anything about that. Okay, so, um... How do you feel right now? What is your current state of mind? I feel happy and excited because my just I just got to talk to my guy, being that he was gone for like twenty five hours. He's like, "Oh, I'll be back like it quick, sir." Twenty five hours is not quick. Just saying. <laughs> okay. <laughs> my state of mind is I'm wanting to go to bed. And she wanted to play 20 <laughs> questions. So, there you go. <laughs> what? 20 questions is fun. <sighs> okay, what do you consider your greatest achievement? My greatest achievement. I don't know. My greatest achievement is finishing a freaking video game. Finishing Assassin's Creed. That is a good one, yeah. Yeah. I finished every single thing. Every side quest, every main quest, every freaking thief. Yes. Fucking prostitutes, whatever you want to call them. <laughs> everything in there. Even unlocked every subject 16 thing. It was amazing. First game I completely finished. Besides Dead Island. Yeah, and I got all the trophies unlocked. What about yours? Uh, my greatest achievement, I would have to say probably an, also a video game. I uh, completed South Park completely for the sixth time. <laughs> Okay, um, what two people, living or dead, have the most influence on you? Name the roles and reasons. I would have to say Leonardo da Vinci as my dead person because I think he's a really amazing person. He invented a lot of great stuff, actually. I, and he has amazing poems and stuff. You should read them. Check them out. And my living one would have to be, um, my mom. Even though, like, I hate her, she has some very valid points. Sometimes she'll be like, "Oh, when I tell you this, you'll be like, you'll, you'll, when you grow up, you'll think and say, oh, I guess she was right.' And actually, some things that she said, I'm like, oh yeah, I guess she was right.' <laughs> I don't have any. Yeah. What two qualities in people do you most admire and value? Them wanting to cuddle. Guys don't like to cuddle nowadays. It's like, girls like to cuddle. Why can't you just cuddle? They're, okay. And then, yeah. So when they want to cuddle, it's just like, yay. And when they're sweet and they tell you how much they love you. What's yours? I would have to say they have to be funny. And I like them being smart. Smart's always a good one. Yeah. What do you think is the most important life question? Um, <laughs> where do you see yourself in five years? Or what do you want to be when you grow up? No, nobody cares about what you're going to be when you grow up. You end up changing your mind like a thousand times. When I was three, I wanted to be a princess. When I was four, I wanted to be something. <laughs> I don't know. Probably a stripper. <laughs> no, I don't know how to dance on the poles. That's like hard. You have to go twitch. You have to have some amazing upper body strength to do that. I don't even know how people like do like pull ups. It's like, I can't do that. I can barely do one push up. What makes you think I can be a stripper? 
Okay. <laughs> I mean, I've always wondered what it would be like, but I don't actually want to be a stripper. That's strange. What was the <laughs> question again? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> what do you think is the most important life question? Okay, I don't know how we got to strippers, but... <laughs> um, most important life question... Hmm. I don't know. Uh, I would have to say... Where do you see yourself in 20 years? That's a good question. That's what I just said, but I said five years. You said five years. Oh my god, whatever. You said, where do you see yourself? Dude. So where do you see yourself in 20 years? You know, children, a house, a car, I think about a that nice now. job. I think about that now. If you've now. done college. I think about that now. Well, okay, go to the next question. <laughs> There's no more questions. Well, we That's didn't all 20? Well, we skipped one because I didn't understand what it was asking, so... Um... What's your favorite color? Green. Uh, uh, yeah, but they don't know that. I know that, but they don't know that. So look at your face into the camera and say green. Okay. My favorite color is green, if you were wondering. Mine's black. Like, if you look at my closet, it's pretty much black. And gray. There's some blue and white in there. No, don't <laughs> show them. <laughs> well, you said if you look at it, everything in your room is actually black, except your walls. <laughs> Your stereo system, your curtain, your dresser, not your my, TV. Not my bed frame. Okay, not your bed frame. TV stand, your shelf. I'm sorry, I like black. Okay. Most of your clothes. Okay, shut up. Okay. <laughs> your bed. So, that was our video. Hope you guys like it. I'm going to do a shout out to my guy in Arizona. Yeah, he's pretty amazing. I love you. You got anything to say? <laughs> Good night. Good night, peace. No, turn off the video. <laughs>